This Central American country is home to a population of 9.6 million, with women comprising 52% and men 48%, and is characterized predominantly by a youthful demographic. According to official data, more than 59% of the population lives in poverty and more than 32% in extreme poverty. In the realm of humanitarian concerns, the main needs stem from the deep socioeconomic and gender inequality in a context of ongoing violence, forced displacement, gender-based violence, rights violations against women, LGBTQI plus people, children and adolescents, as well as the impacts generated by mixed movements of refugees and migrants. These sustained needs have formed a complex web of risks and vulnerabilities that humanitarian action has been addressing through a cross-sectoral approach. According to the Humanitarian Needs Overview 2023 and the projected HNO analysis for 2024, Honduras faces vulnerability to four critical shocks, food and nutrition security, violence, human mobility and displacement crisis, as well as climate change impacts and disasters. These challenges form the backdrop for the protection sector's identification of four priority protection risks in the country. One, the impact of violence, which is evidenced in homicide rates, femicide rates, forced displacement, restrictions on mobility and freedom, forced recruitment, gender-based violence, among others. Two, the human mobility and displacement crisis generated by the role that Honduras has played as a country of origin of those forced to leave, as well as a country of transit for migrants and refugees moving to the north of the continent. Three, gender-based violence and the effects of the multi-crisis on women, girls, LGBTQI plus individuals, and women rights advocates. And four, the differential impacts on children and adolescents. To change this reality, we estimate a need of 280 million American dollars. We have made progress toward this goal, although we've only reached 14% of the target so far. With your help, we can have a significant and positive impact on the well-being and dignity of those in need. Thank you for your life-saving support.